James, five out of five now, and uh, what a way to do it. Yeah, comprehensive in the end. Um, obviously a fresh wicket, but played, I think, better than the, the ones did previously, or the one did previously at the start. Um, so, yeah, a bit cautious at the start, trying to get used to conditions. Um, got Presti after a few balls, played a really important knock there, um, placed a few balls in the power play and got the momentum going. And then, yeah, we thought it was a decent pitch. A few big overs, we're looking at, we sort of said 180. Um, after sort of eight or nine overs um, and ended up with 220. The way the guys finished was outstanding. Yeah, I mean, after five overs, 20 on the board, there was no sign of things to come. Yeah, as I say, because of the wicket we played on previously and it being a hybrid, um, it was a bit tricky early previously. Today was a bit easier, definitely. Um, but just, yeah, taking that bit of extra time so we don't, you know, overshoot and make, you know, make sure we're not three or four down in the power play. Something we've spoken about and thought we did really well. Yeah, I was going to say, you looked as though you were there to bat a long time, your 100. Yeah, I mean, I, I think I only faced 10 or 11 balls in the end in the power play, but um, as I say, Presti at the back end of the power play, I think that over went for 15 or something, gave us a bit of momentum, and then when the spinners came on, there wasn't a huge amount there, so we felt like we could target them. And a strong breeze going to the slightly shorter side, so again, target, targeted that. Um, a few big overs got the momentum going, and Presti, yeah, as I said, was outstanding, and then the way the guys finished, I think we got 24 for last over, which took it from 190 or something up to 220. So, um, yeah, big finish. Your third T20 hundred in your career. You might remember getting 99 in a foggy Canterbury about six years ago. I do. Um, I think we won that game, didn't we? We'd ran out of runs. Uh, yeah, obviously nice. Personal milestones are nice. Um, but yeah, I felt in reasonable touch, but um, yeah, clearing the ropes. Got better as I went on tonight, so hopefully can kick on from here and, and start striking them a bit cleaner. And that was your third highest team total in the competition tonight. Yeah, I think we've kind of, you know, after the first four games, um, weren't getting off to great starts. I think taking that bit of extra time early, summing up conditions, um, has played a big part in that. And it means the guys coming in at the back end can play freely. And as I say, it was a really good wicket. So, you know, the way Joe and Ross can strike it at the back end, Foz wasn't needed today, but a lot of power there. So um, we still want to be positive up front, but, you know, on new pitches, taking that bit of extra time to get to know conditions, I think is important. Incredible turnaround now, isn't it? Four losses and now five wins on the bounce. Yes, yeah, it was looking pretty bleak a, a couple of weeks ago, but um, yeah, the guys have been really good. I think the bowlers have been exceptional. Um, obviously, conditions getting better and better here, game by game. It's important today that we came out and took wickets early. We knew they had to come hard. Um, getting them two or three down reasonably early on was a massive factor. But you know, even through the middle there, although the board said 16, 17, and over, when you're out there. I never feel like the game's done, so the way Woody and Nelly bowled at the end was fantastic. You're climbing the table, but the top two won tonight as well, didn't they? Sorry on Somerset. Yeah, we still got them to play. Um, I think, yeah, after the start we got off to in the competition, you know, making making sure we get into the top four um, is first priority. And then if at the back end we get we keep this momentum going and we can, as I say, play them and beat them, you know, we might end up in the top two. But still a lot of work to be done to make sure we make the top four.